Hey, welcome to Azure Fun Bites. My name is Jay Gordon. I'm your host. Let's get into it. Microsoft Azure has a number of different storage options. You can offload the need to manage the various types of disk or storage endpoints. Let's go over them really quick so you're ready to start using Azure. An Azure storage account contains all of your Azure storage data objects, blobs, files, queues, tables, and disks. The storage account provides a unique namespace for your Azure storage data that's accessible from anywhere in the world over HTTP or HTTPS. Data in your Azure storage account is durable and highly available, secure, and massively scalable. Here are a few different types of storage options for Azure and their use cases. Azure files are fully managed file shares in the cloud that are accessible via the industry standard SMB protocol or server message block. Need to share files with several different VMs? This is a great solution for you. Data Lake Storage. Run big data analytics using fast storage optimized for massive scale. Designed from the start to service multiple petabytes of information while sustaining hundreds of gigabytes of throughput. Data Lake Storage Gen 2 allows you to easily manage massive amounts of data. A great option if you want to run something like Hadoop in the cloud against your big data sets. Disk. E block level storage for your VMs? This is your selection completely virtualized and managed hard disks for your Azure virtual machines with 99.999% availability. Managed disks support availability zones, which is a high availability offering that protects your applications from data center failures. Perfect for those who have solutions that may need VMs and an SSD. Azure Blob Storage is Microsoft's object storage solution for the cloud. Blob Storage is optimized for storing massive amounts of unstructured data. Unstructured data is data that doesn't adhere to a particular data model or definition, such as text or binary data. If you have a website with lots of static images, this is a great place for you to host them rather than on the local disk. Archive. Optimized for storing data that is frequently accessed and stored for at least 30 days. This is ideal for cold storage of old data or files that you made to retain for compliance reasons. A VRV FXT for Azure provides a cloud-based cache layer for data-intensive high-performing computing tasks. Those are all the major storage types for Azure. For more info and to sign up for $200 in Azure credit, see the links in the description. Once again, I'm Jay, and see you next time on Azure Fortnite.